Most people can get the standard 4 feet by 8 feet sheets, but not the bigger ones. I have used a single sheet, the 4 by 8 sheet, to build a boat, but it can handle around 160 pounds. Also, the boat is slow. I have tried to tape two sheets together. The boat is usable, but I am concerned about its integrity and it probably won't last. Before we jump into other methods to make a sheet larger, let's take a look at the design goals. I need to support high payload. My body weighs between 140 to 160 pounds. Some people weigh a lot more. When I carry water bottle, pedal, food, life jacket, PFD, I'll allow another 10 pounds. And then the weight of the boat plus the chair could be 20 to 30 pounds. And if I like fishing, I will have to bring some fishing gears. In some of my design, I even put trolling motor plus battery on it. That by itself is uh, close to 40-ish pounds. So let's say I need 190 pounds for now. It has to be fun to paddle. I'm not saying it has to be very fast. But when you paddle, you should feel your boat is moving. I, I've experienced that I keep on paddling. The boat doesn't really move much, which was my very first boat. It has to be stable and safe. You may encounter wicks and weight from the multiples, and you can handle that conditions. It has to be easy to build, and the boat can last for a few seasons. Foldable is one of the major requirements. And cost-wise, I still want to keep it as low as possible. Again, all the boats I design is just for river and lakes, not really for ocean going or white water. My suggestion today is, I would suggest you to build a pontoon boat. Look at this one. I would call this one as a rowboat. And I'm going to do a comparison. The major drawback is, it couldn't handle higher payload. And it's not that fun to row. With a pontoon boat, I get all yes here. Again, all this comparison are relative to each other. I come up with a tentative design based on a 4 feet by 8 feet size coral plus. The cross section of the pontoon is 6 inches at the base, 1 foot at the top. With this dimension, I can estimate a 6 inches draft. Each pontoon can handle 120 pounds. Two pontoons, 240 pounds. The weight of the pontoons plus the frame, the chair, maybe 30 pounds. So I still have 210 pounds for other usages, such as your body weight, your fishing gears. If I adopt the bow and the stern to be similar to the kayak I have, and I will have increased the buoyancy. That means pot potentially I can support slightly a little bit more payload. But being conservative, I don't want to count on it at this time. Actually, I'm designing another pontoon. I hope I can get it done in the next few weeks. I will share that if it's successful. Please subscribe if you find these videos useful. Thanks for watching.